Hello, I'm back, Lutra FM. Hope you haven't missed me too much. And um, where we left off last, basically, we finished the season. We finished eighth in the league in the end. Um, we could have got up to, we could have got seventh place in the end, but we, um, I think we drew or lost. I can't remember last game of the season. So, oh, we lost. Yeah, we lost. So, yeah, so we lost and Grenoble lost. So it meant Grenoble was seventh in the league but we're still eighth which is really good considering we were only meant to avoid relegation so that's good um and then obviously we've upgraded the facilities we've maxed out which everything now we own the stadium so hopefully we can expand that or build a new stadium eventually and um, we're gonna have a busy summer ahead of us there might be a few players go in there might be um a few favorites of people might end up going if we get decent offers for them so we'll just have to see how it goes. Um, the one, the only one player I don't want to lose is one of the players I definitely don't want to lose is Kofi, and probably Fatar because they were amazing last season. But you know, if we get good enough offers, we've we've got to, the whole purpose of the save is just to keep moving players on and replace them with the players from the new team. So we'll just see how that goes. But yeah, anyway, I'll be back in a minute with the first bit of the episode. This episode is going to be a bit of a weird one because it's going to be little bits of clips put together because um, the fact is we won't have a game for a while because it's pre-season and stuff. So, yeah, just bear with us on that one. But, yeah, I'll be back in a sec. Right, so we're back. Um, what I decided to do, because there wasn't really much to talk about during pre-season and stuff, so I'm just going to do a quick summary now before our first game of the season against Clement Fort. Um, so transfer wise, we didn't really get rid of anyone. We didn't really have any decent offers. We sent a load of people out alone, um, and that we released a few people. The big transfer was towards the end of last season when we sold Malcolm Viltar to Orleans uh, for two million plus thirty percent of the profit of the next transfer. So obviously he will be sorely missed. But he wasn't happy in the tactic I'm using in the role that he's playing. So it was time to move him on. Um, we managed to get a decent offer for him in the end. Two million. I would have liked more for him. But, I mean, you look at this. If he does well, he um, if he goes to, say, five million, we'll get 30% of the three million. So that's uh, just, uh, just under a million. So in the end, it'll work out pretty good. And then obviously the better he does, the more money we'll make if they do sell him. So yeah, so that's that. There's not really, like I said, there's not really much on the old transfer front. Um, trying to think what else. Let's have a look at pre-season. So pre-season we did okay. We lost, we lost two and won two. Um, so there's that. And then competitions wise, let's have a look. So yeah, as I said, Leon got promoted. So if we look at the season preview. Preview, sorry. We are meant to finish 13th, but I think that's a bit harsh because I feel like we can do better than that. Um, but yeah, so Troys are meant to... Troys are the favourites to be champions, followed by Angers, followed by Orcs, uh, Mets and Clement. So I do think, depending on how we do, I think we'll we'll be all right. I think we'll be in there. Um, but yeah, so there's that really. So we'll just... We'll be starting the episode with the first game of season three um yeah i just didn't see the point in dedicating an episode to pre-season because i felt like it was just boring really it wasn't really worth doing there we go it's the lineup for the first game of the season we've got pop up in goal gavers is right back diagne and bossy in center defense bastian's left back tessie and drama in midfield and then fatar Passard on the wings kofi and Vaz up front um, Weisbeck would normally be playing, but he, just before this game, he got injured for three or four weeks. So uh, he's not playing, that's why Fatar is in there. Or else Fatar would probably be up front with Kofi again. Right, first highlight of the game goes to Clement. Clement, sorry. Clement um, will be looking to win this game because they got relegated. They want to probably get a good start in the league. So we've got to be at our best, and then we're doing well defensively so far. That's one position. That's like that's something we do need to strengthen through the youth intakes is get better defensive players 
we're doing all we're doing really well when it comes to the attacking players. Um, defensively, not so much. Tar with the corner now. Floats it in. Oh, look at that for a blaster overhead of there. Like that by Bastion. One nil up. Doing well so far in the first half. Nobody playing badly so far, by the looks of it. Um, quiet first half, not many highlights so far. But if I win 1 0, first game of the season, I'm alright with that. Players look motivated in this game. Ah, uh, Pazard's not playing well there. Give him some encouragement, hopefully that'll help. Let's have the reverse of what I wanted. Right, Bazaar's coming off then. We'll put Kamara on there. See how Kamara does. Yeah, I will miss Viltard. Um, but he doesn't want to play in the tactic that I'm doing. I could have pushed him slightly forward in a more favourable position for him, but I don't want to tinker with what we've got because we did well. We've done well last season. We got eighth place. I feel like we can do better this season. So he had to go for that reason. He wasn't willing to. Oh, he wasn't willing to uh, settle in the tactic I was using. So he's got to do what's best for his career, and I've got to do what's best for the club. Uh, we're lacking strikers on the bench, so Carl Zenti will have to come on. Um, swap him over with Fatar. And then Drame can come off, and we'll put on Accra. And Galvez can come off, put on De Costa. There we go. Right, not long now, left of the game. Let's hope we can just keep this lead or extend it. Accra. Gives it to Costa. Arzenti with the ball. Passes it back to the Agni. I feel like we're lacking confidence here. I think we're going to... No, no, no. Prove me wrong. Right, Fatah drives it forward. Passes it to Arzenti. Arzenti nearly loses it, but gives it to Tete. Tete, go on, Tete. Tete, the um, replacement for Viltard. He's doing very well. Oh uh, yeah, good. 2-0. Good start to the season. Bastion with the throw in. Passes it to Kamara. Kamara now. Oh, nearly. That's right. Baxter wants to jump up. Hello. Hello. Not not during the game, please. Thank you. No. Tim settled, hopefully. A good win to start the episode. And I'll uh, be back in a sec with the next game against Kane. So we're, uh, we're back now. We've got Kane in the next game. Um, pretty much unchanged team, I think. Uh, Galvez is not 100% because he had a picked up an injury. Day in actually on the left. Fatal's on the right. And then Kofi and Baz up front. See how we get on. <laughs> Nothing happening so far. First highlight of the game is to Ooh. them. No, sorry, us. I apologise. We're in the white. That was Baxter, the dog yawning, by the way. Heard a weird noise. He had a mad 10 minutes where he went a bit crazy. He was trying to bite, not uh, nip at me like puppies do. And uh, I'm hoping now he'll come. Yeah, he's he's getting he's going back to sleep again. Right, Kofi. Oh, lucky.
corner to us. Headed out. Diving header by the opposition there. Kofi gets the ball back though. Passes it across to Tete. Um, Bastian now passes it in across, uh, pass it inside to Bossy. Right, there we go. Nice little bit of passing going on here. Deho drives forward, loses the ball, unfortunately. I thought I'd give Deho another chance, and I think I'm regretting this now. Oh, good save. Baxter's not settling after all. Right. So offside by them. Still nil nil though, not too bad. Try and encourage the players a bit, hopefully that'll help. Some people not performing at the moment, like um Baz. And uh, um, who else? Oh, I think it's just Vaz at the moment, actually. All right, tried encouraging Vaz. Hopefully, that'll help. Oh, good interception there by Drame. Tete gives it to Kofi. Kofi, oh, Kofi nearly scored his first goal of the season. Batar with the corner now. Floats it up, headed out, has another go at it, drives inside the box, passes it, but fails miserably with the pass. Right, Baz is coming off. So, we'll have to do what we did like last game. And then we'll swap the tar for Kazenti. Uh, Fatar's not playing well either. Uh, let's try and demand more off Fatar. Hopefully that'll help. Changing his position might help him as well. Day home just lets the player go past him. Good tackle. Ah, uh, own goal, my bossy. He was doing well as well after, before that own goal. Right, Fatah had to come off. We've got De Costa in now, who's a right back. Which means we can't take Galvez off. We take Drame off though. Uh, oh, actually, we can take off uh, Galvez. Uh, anybody else we could take off? Tete maybe. Yeah, Akra could come on for Tete. And then we could take Deo off and put Kamara. Right, Mendy. Oof. Right, let's hope that all these substitutions will fix the problem. Actually, we need to put... Uh, where is the Costa? The Costa is playing up front. That's not happening. He's not a striker. No, I thought we were going to get the ball though. It's been a bit of a rubbish game this time. It's been boring and, and we've not been winning. It's a combination of two. It's not good. Come on, let's get the ball. Let's not concede another one. Oh. Nearly pop off, nearly uh, failed there. We can't take any more players off. Uh, fire up. I'll see if I can fire up the players in a minute. Popov is having an amazing game. He's he's made some really good saves in this this one. Right, see if we can get a late equaliser here. Oh, Kofi, you could have done better than that. Uh, typical uh, FM fashion, we win one, we lose one. We'll probably win the next one, then lose the next one. Corner to them. I think they're just doing this on purpose now, wasting a bit of time. They're going to score again in a second. Let's just see it. Oh, maybe not. Counter-attacking here? No.
Oh well. So we lost that one nil. Not the end of the world. Luckily, it's very early into the season. So I uh, hope we beat Mets in the next game. But we'll see in a minute. I'll be back in a sec. Right, we're back. Um, just a little bit of news before we start this game. Uh, De Costa was moaning about the lack of first team football, so he is. He has been offered out at 29 years old. Um, he's been okay cover, but just not good enough in the long run. So we'll just get rid of him. There's that really. So that's another one of the old guard out, hopefully. Um, but yeah, we've got a lot in sense defence. But other than that, I think it's pretty much the same team as before. Uh, hopefully we can beat FC Mets, but they will be a very strong team. They'll be one of the favourites to get promoted. First highlight goes to them annoyingly. I had a really, really fun save with FC Mets a few years ago. Um, managed to win the French Cup as well. Um, Parfait um, Gouagon, and I can't pronounce his name though. He managed to score um, a free kick to win the French Cup. Like I said, one of the most fun saves I've ever had. FC Mets have got a really good track record of producing good players um, or like like making players better. Um, Sado Mane, I think he was in the FC Mets youth recruitment, uh, youth academy, sorry. And there's other players, but I can't remember the top of my head now. Actually, uh, be able to tell on here, actually. FC Mets, where are you? We go on here. Should be able to. It should say some of the form players on here as well. Maybe. Robert Pierre's was one of them, I think. Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay. Um, but, yeah, just Google it. Just Google former notable FC Mets players. There was loads. I just I just got a brain fart and I can't remember. But yeah, quite a fun save with FC Mets. I might actually. Um, I'm currently doing a save with Cadbury Athletic in the lower divisions of England. I've managed to get them promoted to the Southern Premier Midlands League, um, which is quite a few promotions up. I think the next one up is uh, the Varana Rama. Uh, north and south and I'm currently in the playoffs with like two games to go so yeah so hopefully I can get promoted again with Cadbury Athletic but, yeah quite a fun save with them but once I achieve what I achieve with them I'll because we've still got a while left before um, FM 25 comes out and because I play at a, a certain fast speed Playing this game, as people have noticed on here, um, I can get a season done pretty quickly. So, yeah, so saves get I get bored of saves quicker than most because I can get a season done quicker than most. All right, let's take off um, Galot. Take off Pazard. Take off. Baz. Oh, got to take off Galvez now. Um, there we go. The Costa probably making his last appearance for us. Right, can we counter attack from this? Kofi going all the way here, my looks at it. Go on, Kofi, keep going. Oh my god. After all that. Come on, Kofi. Well that's that then. 2 0. We have not played well in this game. Play three games now, only one one. That is not good. We can't keep making excuses for ourselves against these teams. Yeah, they are better than us, but we've still always got a chance. Come on. 
at least got a consolation goal there, give us a chance. Right, who else can we take off? Right, let's put Acker on. Can we get a consolation game, a goal, sorry? Drama. Get in, go on, we've got a slight chance now, come on. I say that, a slight chance, but they'll probably, Mets will probably score again. When it's all said and done. Um, yeah, Mets probably going to score this now and completely kill our chances of getting a point out of this game. Ooh. Oh well, at least they didn't extend their lead. But yeah, could have done better. Right, and I'll uh, I'll be back in a sec with the last game of the episode. Right, so we're playing Paris FC now. Um, we've got pretty much the same team as the last game, I think. Yeah, pretty much the same team. I think it's exactly the same team, actually. I could be wrong, but anyway. Let's see how we get on. Uh, first highlight goes to Paris FC. Ooh, and then he scored after four minutes played. That's not good. Corner to them now. Good save. Throw into us. Sorry, right, Baxter's playing up. One minute he wants to sit on my lap and then next he wants to go crazy. I can't can't settle him. Um so I am I do apologize for the if I'm slightly distracted. But, uh yeah, Galvez. Um Drame. Passing around here nicely, trying to start the play slowly. Oh, bit of tech is there by Bizarre to get past the player. Get in, go on, Baz. Oh, there we are, VAR. I'll have to wait and see if this if this um, stands or not. Probably won't. Oh, it does. Good. Get in. Well done, Vaz. Vaz with his first goal of the season. Back up to eighth now. To win this game, it will be two wins and two losses for the season so far, which, which obviously gives 50-50. Uh, 50-50. Uh, I think it's 50% win streak. Win percentage then for the season unless my maths is letting me down but we've got to win this game and uh, Paris FC are a very good team corner to us we score this we're in the we're in the uh, winning the driving seat I can't get my words out today I'm so sorry I probably sound really boring I'm, I apologise I'm not the most exciting enthusiastic um, FM YouTuber I can't I can't be like Lelujo. I don't I don't know what he's on to be constantly like that all the time. He he just seems he just seems so positive and happy a lot. Um It doesn't help as well because obviously I wear a mask so it's hard to show facial emotions and stuff like that, facial interactions. Right, we're still one nil up though. And hopefully we can extend our lead in the second half. Good little turn there by Kofi. That's a shame he didn't get past him there. Yeah, go on, Kofi. Blasts it into the top, into the bottom corner there. Second goal of the season for Kofi. 2-0 up against Paris FC, which is really good to see. Bossy. Go on, Bizarre. Get in. Oh, offside. Right, I think it's pretty straightforward. I think unless a player gets knackered now. Oh, there we go. Drame's knackered, so he can come off. 
Akra can come on for you. Um, Fatar can come off on Parsenti. Bastian can come off because he's not good, and we'll put on Costa. Uh, I think that's it, really. I don't think there's anybody else. Um, Bizarre. No, we can't take any more players off anyway. Right, we just got to see this game out now. Corner. Get another chance at it. Headed out. Headed out again. Paris FC on the counter attack now. Will they catch us out? Time will tell. Uh, uh oh. Oh, okay. Oh, no. VAR going to come to our rescue. Let us keep our clean sheet, maybe. VAR checking. Ah, fortunately, goal awarded. Right. We just, I hope to God we don't concede again now. Oh, no. Here we go. Oh, thank God for that. Right, hopefully that's it. Right, so that's that then. That's good. So uh, an average an average episode, two wins, two losses, nothing in the middle. Um let's just have a look at the lead table before we go. Eighth at the moment, four games played, six points. So uh, we're just a couple, we're just one point away from the playoffs, only four points away from Troy's. So not too bad. We're doing well. We're doing well. I'm gonna save this before I forget. Um, but yeah, let me just do this. There we go. Um, yeah, thank you. Decent episode this one. I appreciate your support. Um, if you haven't already, subscribe, like the videos, leave me a comment as always. Uh, enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll be back. Um. I'll be back on Friday with another episode. Goodbye. Bye.